Okay, so welcome to week two, a time to repent message in a minute. We're continuing our journey through Advent using Tom Wright's themes from uh, as he looks in Matthew. And we're thinking about this concept of uh, time to repent. Now, in church throughout Advent, we, we light a candle each week of Advent. And each week, each of those candles represents a different group or a different person within the overarching picture of the Bible. And in week three, so we're a little bit ahead of ourselves, we light a candle and we remember John the Baptist. Now John the Baptist was the one who came before Jesus to prepare people for what Jesus was um, coming to do. Now it's actually in Luke's Gospel that we read about the birth of uh, John the Baptist and we read about the birth of his mother. But Matthew's Gospel has a lot about the ministry of John. And John's ministry was a calling to the people of God to repent. Now repent is about more than simply saying sorry. Repent is, 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 is not really about saying, oh, I'm really sorry. Repent, actually, the language means that we turn and we walk in another direction. And John was calling people to turn away from the, the life that they were living that was opposed to God and turn and instead walk towards God, walk in the direction. And I wonder, as we journey through this Advent, are there things that we need to do, that we need to put aside and say, you know what, I'm not going to do that. Instead, I'm going to turn and I'm going to focus on what God is calling me to. Now I wonder if that's something that we can be thinking about as we journey through Advent. Take care.